Yo, this your boy Double Up and I'm back with another uh, uh, banger And today, we about to get into that boy Adam22 Alongside with Wack 100 You know, they about to talk about the questions that Kodak Black didn't want to be asked You get what I'm saying? So we, we before we start this video, I need you to like, comment, subscribe Let's get right into this content So how was the Kodak? Did I tell you about him? Now, do you believe uh, me when I tell you that's him? Yeah, but a big part of your argument was like, oh, he's not on drugs. No. And then right after that, he's, he, he does an interview. He says he did 100 perks a day for a while. No, when I'm, no. he wasn't f***ed up. He's Kodak up. was is always, well, at that time, was always feeling good. Mm. But when he's like... As long as he can have a conversation with you, and you know you gotta listen to him because he'll go into this mumble whisper sh mm. He's making sense. It's when he says that has nothing to do with what you talking about, nephew up. There was a moment where he took my phone. And just to be fair, bruh, it ain't just Kodak that talk like that. It's just a Florida thing. You know, I'm from Florida. So we got like a little mumble thing, you know what I'm saying? We can do this like this type, you know what I'm saying? Like, we just talk different, you get what I'm saying? I understand everything that boy talking about. Let's get back into the content. Looked at my questions and basically said, don't ask that one, that one, and that one. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> you see what I'm saying? It was like probably the most challenging interview I've ever tried what to do. Was it, it was at three in the morning. One of them was about just a music video that he had out that got deleted. He took it down and I wanted to know why. <laughs> You made it pretty clear. Don't ask about that. You didn't even ask him in the parking lot so you can talk about it later. You no, don't that's, know how to play the no game. that's not how we do interviews. We just ask the question on here. But there was a bunch of people featured on the record, some of which he may not f with anymore. He probably didn't want to get into the nitty gritty of why he doesn't fuck with people. Totally understandable. But as an interviewer, kind of weird for the person to take your phone and tell you, right, anyway, I'm going to double back. I'll find another Little yak Boosie, interview. We in need the that dismissal paperwork, bro. We got the paperwork when you was telling on the security guard. We ain't going for the state of California says uh, you can have an a illegal gun. That don't work with us. Wait a minute. We need the dismissal paperwork. You're saying that Boosie snitched on somebody? That's a fact. A security we guard. Got the Hold on, man. So this boy Wack 100 always talking about he got some stuff, man. Talking about that boy Boosie snitched. But I don't know too much. I don't know if I believe him. But half the time, he be right. But I doubt Boosty Snitch because he a real one. But let's get back into the content. Hopefully, it'll come out and see what's really going on. How you guys think. How you guys feel. Drop it in the comments. Let's get back into the content. Work. And now, all of a sudden, the case disappears. Right? So, at the end of the day, listen. Right? In what he situation? Quit, he just called, what's this dude, Rollo or something, a rat? Rollo. Right? Rollo's he a called smart. Rollo a rat? Hey, he's the smartest rat I've heard. Rollo. Because he said, I'm not doing it. I'm walking with God. I'm not stupid to your level. Right? He is not about to amplify his situation. It looks like this was a year ago. Boosie and Rollo go off on each other over snitch allegations in Rollo's case. I don't know. Something must have just happened, bro. N word, you are talking right. about it. So, what I'm saying, but listen. Let's fight. Hey, look, bro. It's, it's a couple things that when you ask for them, you got to provide them. Mm -hmm. A bail receipt and dismissal paperwork. I'm not saying anything recent about this. but well, Yeah, they were just talking about it. A bail receipt and dismissal paperwork. Okay. Bro, you have to post that dismissal work. Mm. That's it. You know. You but hold on. Before that boy Wack 100 said... Boosie a rat. So, do you have the paperwork? You say you can't do it without the paperwork. Do you think Boosie a rat? Do you think Rollo a rat? You get what I'm saying? Do you think he is 6'9? I doubt Boosie is 6'9, but let's get back into the content. You can't be calling, you call TI Rollo out on this. Shit. 
we got to work when you told the police both guns belong to the security guard. And the security guard is saying, only one gun is mine and I'm licensed for it. They put both guns on the security guard, he going to jail, lose his license, right? He checked one gun on the plane to come to California. You had the rat dude from the San Diego Crip dude who using his phone to identify a boosie had a gun. This is why when they pulled him over, they snatched him out. When they took him to the station, they telling him, hey. You're talking about the guy who was on IG Live who yeah. captured Boosie with a gun I on him. exposed him on Clubhouse. But you're saying that guy was an informant? He was an informant. Not only was he an informant, and that phone was working like a wiretap, I pulled up his work where he got 15 people indicted from his city. And he wrote the judge a letter begging not to go to court with these individuals. We pulled him on Clubhouse over there and, and exposed him, mm -hmm. right? So my thing is, Boosie is telling the, the, the police they telling them, be quiet, let us Miranda you, right? Mm -hmm. Be quiet, let us show you something first. No, both of them the security gun. Only one of them security gun. You At the end of the day, I mean, if you got paid security and they supposed to handle your, your, your weapons, you get what I'm saying? Is this snitching saying it's theirs? Especially if you paying them, you know, you really ain't supposed to say anything. You get what I'm saying? You're supposed to say, let me see my lawyer. But do you guys think it's snitching? Let's get back into this content. Put a, you put an unauthorized pistol on illegal security. That's just like me having a motherfucking gun. He going to jail. He going to lose his license. Then they show him the video. This is why we know this gun was on you. It said in the work. Now all of a sudden, the case di disappears. Bro, respectfully, I don't give a fuck. All y'all out there, look, be a Boosie fan. All that. But when niggas is talking this gangster shit... And playing these gangster games by these gangster rules, you bro, this is what it is. Has Boosie responded yet? We need I to mean, this. We need to see the dismissal work, bro. I put mine up. Boom. So if Boosie pull up the dismissal work and it shows that he didn't rat, is White One Hundred going like take that back? Because you can't be saying the man a rat without the paperwork. You just said that, man. You contradicting yourself, old man. But let's get back into it. When you ask me a question, I put my shit up. No Just so problem. you know, if Boosie makes the call, you'll never do another Vlad interview again. Like that. I'm not worried about that. Vlad, don't nobody call shots on Vlad and Boosie, like this. This is what's real, though. Vlad is going to stand behind what's real. Bro, anybody from the streets on Paru that if somebody Paru. say, hey, bro, how you get out? I bailed out. Will your bail receipt? Mm-hmm. If you write it to get out, you ain't gonna have that. I beat the case. Will your dismissal? Will your work? You shouldn't feel no kind of way, bro. Mm. I'm not. Listen, man. Fuck all that. This was real. You know what I'm saying? He need to show that, bro. We need to see that, bro. Put that shit up like you put up everything else, and we all put up everything else. You show the fish. You show the uh uh your build you doing at your crib. I salute you on that. Beautiful spread. You know, you show this, you show that, show the dismissal work. Yeah, I don't know. No. Man, sometimes I just think White 100 just be talking, you know what I'm saying? That boy don't really got to post anything. If he really a rat, it eventually come out. I don't see how this was like uh, what the questions that Kodak was forbidden to be asked. You get what I'm saying? He only said one. But I want to know how you guys feeling. Let's drop it in the comments, man. I'm a little sick. Excuse me. You know what I'm saying? If you see me with it, it ain't no, it ain't none of that. Nah, I'm just got a little cold. All right, let's get back into this content. No comment, but wow. No you, comment. You telling me that Boosie told? That's like telling me that Santa Claus ain't real. Hey, look, would a motherfucker accept at 25? Don't mean he going to accept it at 45. Mm. So you're saying that his standards may have loosened up a bit. Gun cases just don't disappear. Mm. Nigga, what a dismissal. My, the little homie Bozzy, he get it dropped in the, st in the county, in the state. Mm. Feds pick it up, send the homie to the feds for a year. Uh -huh. All right, that's the end of that, man. I want to know how you guys feel, man. Do you feel like Boosie is a rat, first of all? And do you feel like Kodak Black should have had questions that he preferred Adam at 22 to ask him? Me, personally... I think that was a smart idea because you know how Adam 22 can get. He messy as hell. But uh, until next time, I'm out.